chess. Done. Yep, that one. Good. Excellent. I love the decor. Ogre boss? Possibly. Um, I wouldn't touch that sock. That's a cup. That thing you put dead people in. You can get bad feeling. I also have a bad feeling. It's also surrounded by bones, but you know. I don't really have a choice. I just have- I gotta touch it. Oh, fear. I know I had something that had- Oh, I don't have my equipment! That's where all of my saving throws and the immunity affecting spells went. They were good. Can I, uh... Shoot him from afar? With the short bow. Am I ever going to get out of this corner? Deacon, do you want to attack him? No? That's the problem with mummies these days, you know? It's just one fear and you're stuck in a corner for the rest of the game. Oh, I only needed a roll of 14. Could have done it too. Come on! Freaking wear off already. There we go. You shall feel my wrath. Am I doing damage? No. But at least I'm not going to get feared. The good news is he might actually die. Deacon decided to go with the sword for this one. I don't know why. You have a short you have a short bow, Deacon. I know you do. Or a crossbow or something. You do. The mummy little gonna heal himself. Nope. Alright. Well, I mean, I guess that works. Where do my swords go? Here they are. Yeah. Uh, cool. Now, what's in the chest? Ooh, greater amulet of health. What does the greater amulet of health do anyway? Ooh. Immunity to disease, level ability drain, poison, and a regen. I might just take that. I could use regen. That's over and done with. Come, Deacon! Ooh, good thing Deacon bring flask. It's so dry in here. Tell me about it. Dungeons these days, am I right? Quick save. Off we go. Ogre. What? Where did he come from? Oh well. Stabby stab. We're not gonna touch that for a sec. Oh my, there's a lot of people here. That's alright. It's not like they take very long to kill. We're okay. Mm -hmm. Yep, we can kill him. And him. I'm sure more seasoned players of this game would criticize my build for like the next 30 years if they could. Do I care? No. I get the job done. I kill stuff. Could I spend way more time deciding what my build was? Yes. 
Could I just spend hours researching what the best build for a rogue was? Yes. But am I gonna do that? No. Yeah, leave the chest unlocked, but lock the crate. Whose bright idea was that? Anyway. There be a chest here. It looks like it could be a trapped one. Are you trapped? I'm gonna say no. Nice. Try to avoid that poison. Thought there was one there, Deacon. If you want to kill the orc, that'd be awesome. This battle will be your loss. Or maybe he's just gonna throw calculus at me. Hall of the Ogre Mage. What could possibly go wrong? Hall of the Ogre Mage. Oh look, an Ogre Mage! Fire Bear, kill it! Kill him. Olgen Hasterian. Weapon ineffective? Bullshit! Stone skin? Is it stone skin? Oh, there we go. Now I can... Oh no. I just really want to see what this glowing fountain does. So if you don't mind. Yeah. My weapon has had no effect! Yeah, I know, because he's got stone skin on! Just kill him faster, bitch! Come on! Stop complaining! God. And they've disappeared. Oh, you there shall be. That works. Where's the mage? He's around here somewhere. There he is. He's healing himself! You fucker! Okay, well if I can't damage him with this weapon, what should I be attacking him with? I don't have any magic or anything. I mean, shit. Well, oh, okay, we're, we're off. It's all right. We'll just try to do as much damage as we- There we go! Maybe you can talk to him now. All right. The ogre wrinkles his brow and bares his teeth in what could only be vaguely called a smile. It is a frightening smile, to say the least. I'm obviously no match for you, my good friend. But we're both civilized creatures. There's no need to kill me. You defeated me in good cavalier fashion, so what would you have me do? You're pretty well spoken for an ogre. Yes, yes, I know. I'm supposed to sound vacant minded like me crush you good, but if I only But I only play on stereotype to keep my enemies off guard. Being a powerful wizard, you'd think people would realize I'm also highly intelligent. But they see this body and assume the worst. My enemies tend to underestimate me, except for you, of course. Deacon knows just how you feel. People is mean to me just because I is kobold. <laughs> but if they let Deacon sings for them, maybe they not hates me so much. People just need time to get used to you, Deacon. <laughs> I suppose it's safe to assume that my forces have been devastated beyond repair. So it seems that oversized fairy will rule this level after all. What are your terms of surrender? What fairy? Well, shatter my skull. I just assumed you were an agent of the Fairy Queen and sent to best my army. This is a far superior situation. Tell me about the Fairy Queen. Recently, Ender Mountain has undergone a fundamental shift in the paradigms of power. Needless to say, I sought to capitalize on this change. I began to recruit followers and spread my influence through this level. Apparently, the Fairy Queen has a similar plan. It was inevitable that our respective minions would clash. I thought this war would end quickly, but her fey powers to charm and dominate have prolonged the hostilities. I mentioned a power shift. Not so much a shift, really, more like a vacuum. Halaster used to keep us all in line, but now that he's gone, it's anarchy. He's gone? Yes. We know he's gone. Other guy said so. Once I realized Halaster was in absentia, 
I decided to try and increase my own power by seizing control of this level of Undermountain. Apparently the Fairy Queen had similar ideas. I want to ask you some questions. Uh, tell me about the Fairy Queen. Okay, apparently he's not going to tell us about the Fairy Queen. Other than... Other... She is other person. Uh... Do you know how to get down below this level? There was a passage leading down, though I couldn't tell you where it is exactly. Undermountain has a habit of changing, you see. Things move every so often. Alistair likes to keep us off balance. But the tunnel collapsed in any case. During one of my battles with the Fairy Queen, forces a spell I unleashed caved it in, sealing it with tons of rock. The ogre rubs his chin in deep thought for a few seconds. I suppose you could blast your way through the debris. Yes, that might be possible given the resources of this level. And bring water deep down on my head? If you're careful to put the ingredients together in the right mixtures, there's an excellent chance the explosion could be controlled. I'm fairly confident it won't kill you. You might be able to find a keg of alchemist fire. Those have quite a nice explosion. Halister kept a few of them stashed around down here. Sweet. Okay, cool. Ask you some questions. Uh, how did you end up here? Yeah, he just tried to get there. Alistair put him here. Free to go. He seems like a civilized sort of fellow. Sorry for blocking your way there, sir. Uh, easel? Was he doing paintings? Ooh, fire opal. I'll take that. There's a bench. There's a fountain, which doesn't seem to do anything. Crates. Oh, whoops. I do- I should really up my search. Just saying. Luckily my saving throws are exceptional. Got a torch. What about these guys? No? Alright. Take everything. Ugh! Red rod. Well, I've got lots of rods now, and I don't know what any of them do. So I suppose we're going this way. I heard a door open. Drow! Kill him! Where are the others, my ass, bitch? You're going down! Oh, fuck. We made it out. This is not the end. Kill him! Alright, it's fine now. Ooh. See the drow drops up. Wow, look at all the shiny things they dropped. That guy had a lot of stuff. Ooh, green armor. Ugh. Slow goings. It's alright, we'll make it. Oh, I'm over encumbered. That's what it is. It's alright. You shall feel my No need to be unencumbered in order to kill these guys. Uh, shall we find the mage? There he is. A battle cleric? Really? He's doing the summons? Weird. Deacon knows where he is. <laughs> Don't you there, Deacon. Any time now. Damn. And heal. Fuck you. And more heal. Damn, that 50% concealment is just shitty as fuck. I hate this. Oh, I knew it. Fucking heal spell. 
This is going to take me forever until they run out of instances of the spell to cast. Ow! Okay, Deacon doesn't seem to be getting hit by that. I think we're alright. You alright there, Deacon? Money! Nice. Oh, right. I'm encumbered. Uh, Deacon, you wanna hold some of this stuff? Like, everything? He can only hold 86 pounds. You know what it is. It's this shit. Weighs a ton. 70. No! Here, you want a harp of haunting? You can have a harp of haunting. That's better. I really want to sell these things. I can drop the box. I don't need that shit. Um. Actually, Deacon, Deacon, if you wouldn't mind, identify my ship, please. That would be great. Hmm. Plus five! Wow! And high plus five, too. 24? 26! And so nice. Ooh, drow longsword. What's the difference? Nothing really, apparently. Rapier of the High Road. Hmm. Boots of Striding plus four. Cowl of Warding? Freedom and immunity to mind affecting spells? Wow! That's way better than what I have. Sure, we'll switch it up. Why not? If I ever run into another mummy, I'm gonna be totally set. Tracks? Locked? Not for long. Spellcraft? What do you mean spellcraft? Whoa. This is the most suspicious thing I've ever run into. Hmm. Bats. And then they fly away. I think that was not correct. Do I have to open these chests in a certain order? That is a horrible sound. No. I am going to keep trying until this makes sense and something else happens other than turning into bats, so... Just so you know. No. I don't care if you consider this cheating. It's happening. Nope. There's only three left to try, don't worry. Last one. Nope. Okay. Apparently there's no way to do this differently. So. Oh well. 